In a time not too long ago, your gal pal Victoria Beyond actually used to make Splatoon 1 for the Nintendo Wii U videos? Preposterous! And it's true! Before I made Splatoon 2 content, I used to make Splatoon 1 content. Did it go anywhere? No. Is it all still up? Yes. And you might be wondering, why do we care about this, Vic? And the answer is, all of those videos still are up, except for just one. And what we're gonna do today is actually watch that one singular video that got taken down on my channel back in the spring of 2018. Most of the people here may not have seen this video, but it has a stupid amount of views because like YouTube kept pushing it in people's faces. They were like, hey, this video, it's now in your recommended. And then like once it got dropped because of the Nintendo Creator Program ending, <laughs> they didn't stop recommending it to people. So I know some people who have never seen this video, but had it recommended to them over and over and over again, and they just never got to watch it. So I'm gonna watch it, because I haven't watched it since it got taken down, and you're gonna watch it because maybe you haven't seen it, because it's been like two years. So let's go. Oh God! <laughs> I gotta turn that down! Oh, it's so loud! Oh, I love this. I love the old music. Uh, so the circle at the start is like, hey guys, look! <laughs> There's a hacker! Did you know that? So the magical thing about this is there is absolutely no commentary. All the commentary is gonna be like down at the bottom of the video. And it's just it's just this music the entire time. And I'm like, uh, oh, oh boy! Oh man! Oh man! The hacker painted everything except the middle of the map! And like, I try to explain what's going on here, and it does help because people like, totally knew what's going on in the video because of it. And this hacker is just like, ah, nah man, nah man, I'm out of here, I'm gonna go win the game. But homeboy, he screws up! And he actually falls out of the map, or, right? Does he fall out of the map yet? Or no? Okay, no. No, I die. I die, okay. And I like, celebrate the fact that he lost, and we're like, ah, yeah, we can play the game now! And I'm like, <laughs> fun fact, the Wii U visuals. Aw oh, man, you know what I miss though? I really miss Urchin Underpass so much. And I'm like, <laughs> the Rainmaker sure is in an interesting spot. Isn't 2017 Vic just so funny and quirky? <laughs> I use like perfect prose for like everything in this video. And now I'm like, I'll just paint around, you know, expecting to play the game some more. Because I haven't really realized, like, the gravity of the situation just yet. But you'll, you'll see soon what the problem is. I'm like, mind you, the hacker is the first squid, so he's gone. And here's the thing, though. So now we're all kind of stuck in this match, but none of us are really fully acknowledging yet. So I'm like, oh, yeah, you know what we can do? We can, we can play this one out. But, like, I haven't really realized the Rainmaker is kind of where it is. So, like, we're all playing this game seriously. Like, it is a 3v4. I'm like, I don't want to fight, but like, they still want to fight, so I try to work my way in, because I'm like, you know what we can do? We can party it up, because that Rainmaker, uh, the Rainmaker isn't really coming down, but like, but no one wants to fight me, so I just like, insert a little, like, sad face into the video here. <laughs> it's so dumb. Ah, oh, it's so good, though, and I'm like, yep. This is the rest of the video, guys, and and this is where people like just start enjoying it because like th this video was literally just called Hacker and a Squid Party, and everyone was like, oh, a hacker in Splatoon and a, and a Squid Party? <laughs> what more? What more would you want? Because that's all people wanted in the old days is they just wanted to watch Squid Parties and funny hacker videos. I mean, you can't tell me you've never watched a video with a hacker before. I have, you have. We've all done it. And now we've attained one friend. Now the magic of Splatoon, <clears throat> the magic of Splatoon 1, of course, is that it's it's literally everybody has the same inkling. There's no octolings. Everyone has the same hairstyle, and that's kind of a uh, that's kind of part of why I have the hairstyle that I do. And I'm just like, oh, you know what? We'll have some fun. We'll just throw ourselves into this <laughs> into this killer whale here. And the poor other guy is like, oh. Why'd you throw yourself into my killer whale? And I'm like, oh, I'm sorry, buddy. And like, I, I still have my, my quirky little subtitles. I'm like, <laughs> the dynamo roller wanted to do something. 
Because basically at this point, it's, it's just an elongated turf war, except we all know who wins already. Us. And I'm like, see, he didn't even get to attack me. Like, props to past Victoria for not putting subtitles, like, the entire time. But, like... <laughs> I, I, I just love the, cho the choice of font, because this is before I had access to the Splatoon font. I also edited this on like, uh, I think like, like, uh, I forget what it's called. It's not Fireworks, it's something very similar, like, uh, Lightworks? Lightworks, yes. So, I, I, I put like the minimal amount of effort in this video. I put it up, and, and many months later, it just blew up for no reason. So we're just jamming here. We've got one friend that knows what they're doing with the party, having the laser light, and the rest of us just kind of just kind of jumping around. Like I don't think I ever consider like going for the rainmaker. I think I just choose it. Also, look in the top right, you can see that I'm wearing this 96, and I actually have um <laughs> just a whole bunch of damage up. This time we don't throw ourselves into the killer whale, which is nice. But like, what do you, what do you do? Look at this. The rainmaker is up there. There's no touching it, and all we can do is just party. Like, I'm thinking they're, like, trying to glitch it out, too, but, like, no one can reach that. I have a feeling that, like, the hacker didn't mean to get it up there, but I've never seen this happen in any other video that I've watched, which is why I think this video was so unique. And, and now we've all seen it, and that's pretty cool, because I, uh, I didn't know I could download this. But yeah, that's, that's it. The guy kills everybody, and the game is over. You get to see that spicy screen with Judd just by himself! Oh, no! And that's it. I put the thanks for watching a little a little too high up above the bar. That's it's not really centered. And the video just ends like that. There's no there's no ending screen. The music just kind of cuts out and that's the video. <laughs> My past content was was very lovingly cobbled together, but it makes me smile to think about it. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this little peek into the past. You enjoyed me rambling about Splatoon 1 a little bit, but also just rambling about the video and its origins and all that jazz. But this was super fun. I had downloaded it the other day and I was like, hey, what if I reshare this video with the world, but I add myself talking over it? And the answer is, it, it makes a content. So, thank you guys for watching and have a good one.